retirement plan sponsors have a fiduciary responsibility to determine that the fees and compensation paid to outside service providers are reasonable. Compensation comes in two forms. One, direct payments from the plan, and two, indirect payments from the plan's investments by way of revenue sharing arrangements. Revenue sharing is a layered expense on top of the investment management fee that the firm running the money is being paid. Whether or not and to what degree mutual fund investments have revenue sharing arrangements is a product of the share class that might be selected. To further complicate things, share classes of similar investments have different revenue sharing amounts uh, associated with them. It's this dynamic that gives rise to two important considerations for plan sponsors that might be using indirect compensation to pay outside service providers. First, it can give rise to a conflict of interest uh, if the investments that are being made available to or recommended to the plan are being driven more by compensation than an independent analysis. And secondarily, certain participants may in practice end up bearing more of the cost of an outside service provider's fee simply as a result of the investment that they selected for their retirement account. At Schneider Downs, we believe in utilizing the lowest cost share class available for investments in an effort to eliminate the consideration of how revenue sharing payments might be accounted for and to improve fee transparency for plan sponsors and participants. We prefer to see fees deducted as a direct debit of against plan assets, either on a pro rata or per participant basis. If you have questions regarding revenue sharing or other components of your plan, please contact our office.